Sicherheit ist wichtig, dass ich auch in der Öffentlichkeit kurz mit dem Ziel gehe. Wir sind mit Minister Collins Schawane. Minister of Public Service and Administration, ahead of the second peer review mechanism that South Africa will soon be undertaking this year, um, having done one about 10 years ago. Minister, today people are asking the question, is there still relevance for the African peer review mechanism? The APRM is a very important institution. It's a very good initiative has been taken by African leaders to, to reform the continental structures. It is relevant and its relevance is confirmed by the number of countries who are willing to join. The number keep on increasing, more and more countries want to participate in the APRM because they see the value of the APRM in reviewing themselves and making sure that they participate in the democratization of their own countries and society. So that for me is the most important element which indicate the relevance of the APRM. Minister, people still think that the APRM is something for heads of states. Do you think for ordinary South Africans there is relevance, there is something to benefit them? Obviously, our history in South Africa is, is a very sad one. Firstly, before, before the Republic of South Africa was declared in, 19, in 1961, um, only um, South Africa was participating in international affairs, but only a small section of it. After that, up until 1994, except through the liberation movements, who were in exile anyway. Uh, only the whites even had passports <laughs> and the rest of the community didn't have. So South Africa has got that deficiency of having to integrate with the continent. But it's very encouraging to see South Africans wanting to participate, to be integrated, even at the political level, with, it, with, the, with, with their counterparts in the continent. Now the fact that this issue has been started by heads of states, if, anyway, they are, they are our leaders. They started it, but South Africans need to participate very vigorously on this process because through this process we'll begin to understand how our counterparts in the continent live and the challenges which they face from time to time. Minister, you mentioned inside that you think um, between the APRMs uh, there should be regular reports that are conducted to make sure that what, what the APRM before had highlighted should be monitored and is implemented. What do you see happening in the next phase of this APRM we are about to conduct? We, we are going to propose <coughs> that uh, the Secretariat should design a mechanism to follow up on the decisions which have been made on all the reports which have been presented to the AU to see to what extent are we, are, we, are we progressing in the implementation of the program of action which arises out of the national reports because there are quite a number of reports which are being presented today and there are more which are still coming from various countries. So the Secretariat should have a monitoring mechanism which monitors the implementation of the uh, commitments which we make uh, because the, most of the work basically is on the states so the commitments which we make at the states which need to be able to monitor that to ensure that we don't get surprised at the end when we have to do the second report that what we agreed upon has not been implemented. Minister, there is a sentiment that the champions of the APRM are gone. People like President Abasanjo, President Tabombeki um, are gone. Therefore, the APRM no longer has champions. Do you think the APRM needs to have new champions? The APRM is being championed now. <coughs> it's being championed because um, from time to time, the forum itself is led by heads of states. It changes from one to the other because we'll have to share responsibility. The secretariat is, is up and running and then the heads of states who are participants, they, they debate very vigorously on these issues. And now that it will be uh, in the AU uh, structures, that the AU has agreed to integrate it in the structures, is going to become the most important component of the AU. And the AU's uh, commission and the AU itself, assembly, will take responsibility for it. I think there will be champions generally who are going to make sure that it happens. Minister, we appreciate you taking time to talk to us.